22 years later, remembering an event that happened before many of them were born. The anniversary of the Tiananmen Square crackdown this year has new faces and names to commemorate, with the detention of artist Ai Weiwei and the awarding of the Nobel Peace Prize to dissident Liu Xiaobo. I uh, haven't seen any progress in democracy or uh, human rights. And uh, with the heightened uh, suppression in China, it's even more important that people come out when our co Chinese compatriot cannot have a voice inside China, we become their voice. The recent crackdown has given a boost to demonstrations ahead of this year's anniversary. This, a protest by activists delivering a coffin to one of the main Chinese government offices here, symbolizing the death of freedom. And in other marches, a familiar figure in the crowd, a model of the goddess of democracy statue that stood in Tiananmen Square and came to represent the spirit of defiance. An even larger statue, which appeared last year, was seized by the authorities on public safety grounds, leading to claims of suppression, but it was eventually given a home here. The only city in China where such symbols are tolerated. If that symbol disappears from Hong Kong, then you know Hong Kong has been wiped out as we know it. When the crackdown happened, the original statue was destroyed along with the hopes of the Beijing protesters. Nearly a generation on, today's activists are hoping it will be restored once more in the capital city of a truly democratic China. Rob McBride, Al Jazeera, Hong Kong.